Hello, with the high rise in catalytic converter theft, I wanted to do a video about preventing theft. Having your catalytic converter stolen on your car, I'm sure is something that no one looks forward to. These parts are expensive to replace and sometimes can even take a while to have it replaced depending on the availability of the part. As you can see on the graph, theft continues to rise. I was thinking about using a small fence type thing to put underneath the car near the catalytic converter covering it but it seemed to be a lot of work to install. I would need to screw down the fence to hold it. I would have to bend the fence to fit it underneath the car. It just seemed like a lot of work just to install it. The anti-theft system in this video is nowhere near an official method of making the catalytic converter unstealable but hopefully this could lessen the chances of the cat getting stolen. There are actually a lot of aftermarket catalytic converter protectors out there. These protectors have a higher chance of preventing theft, but these protectors can be expensive. If you can afford one of these protectors, I would go with one of these instead. But if money is tight right now, you might want to do an alternative anti-theft system. I decided to go with a metal chain. I started out with using a 5 foot metal chain but the chain could not reach all the way across. I wanted to lock one side of the chain then the other side but I couldn't do it with the 5 foot chain. Then I bought an 8 foot chain. This one was able to reach all the way across. I felt that it could be more secure with being able to lock the chain on one side to something on the car and the same for the other side of the chain. So I locked one side of the chain to something and the other side of the chain to something. For this particular car, the catalytic converter looked to be 3 to 5 feet across from end to end so I felt that an 8 foot chain was a good fit. It might even be better to wrap the cat more with chain to secure it more so maybe a longer chain wouldn't hurt. This is the padlock that I used to lock each end of the chain to something on the car. I used two of these locks and these padlocks are not expensive by the way. These are really cheap padlocks compared to other padlocks out there. Regardless if the padlock is cheap, the lock still locks and the hope is that the bad guy will see that it's locked and move on to an easier target. As you can see, there is still some space to cut the catalytic converter and take it. There is still some space on the part not surrounded by chain. If the bad guy was to cut the exposed parts of the catalytic converter, they can still remove it, but they might need additional effort to do it. The hope is that the bad guy will skip this additional effort and just move on. The bad guy may think when he sees the chain surrounding the cat that the owner of the car put in a lot of work to install the chain and so it's best not to ruin it. Or the more possible reason that he might think twice about taking the catalytic converter might be because of the additional work for him to remove the catalytic converter and so it might be better to just move on. Or the chains may slow him down at the same time make noise during the attempt to remove it resulting in the person getting caught by authorities. All of this will hopefully lessen the chances of getting the catalytic converter stolen. So what do you think should be done in terms of laws and regulations to prevent catalytic converter theft? Or what do you think can be done to prevent this type of theft? Feel free to post your opinions in the comments below and thank you so much for watching.